are you a you're a Jessica believer? <laughs> Definitely. Uh, I was actually, I think, one of the first people to put in my approval statement on the stakeholders document. I was really excited for it. I'm an infrastructure uh, provider for BCH. I run the, the cash node.bch.ninja node uh, that serves literally every Selene user right now until the next update. Um, and then plus probably some Electron users as well. So um, it's important to me that uh, BCH stays within the realm of affordability when it comes to uh, being able to host that node. That's also one of the major criticisms. Is, oh, nobody can afford to host a node. Well, uh, I, I can afford to host a node on like a hobby budget. Like even before I started making money in BCH, I was able to afford a node on a part-time job. So it's not actually expensive. Uh, 1.3 terabytes per year in storage if we were maxing out the blocks, which... Um, as far as I'm aware, if we had a 16 megabyte block cap, still the entire crypto ecosystem as it stands today would fit in that block size cap. Um, I think that's based on some research that BCH Autist did before uh, uh, coming up with the algorithm. Excuse me, sorry. Um, so yeah, definitely, definitely a believer. Um, <laughs> I, I'm, I'm stoked for this upgrade. It, it's I think it's the, after cash tokens, it's our next secret weapon, right? Because because we still need to be able to uh, put that social issue into the grave once and for all.